My name is Casey Cameron and I'm the Executive Director of Utah's Workforce Services. So when I think about what prepared me for this role, it's really two things. I've worked in public service for about 23 years in a variety of positions and departments and divisions. For the last eight years, prior to becoming an executive director, I had the opportunity to work as a deputy director. And I think that was a really strong training ground for this job that I'm in now. I come from a background of farmers. So I got to go and work on those farms growing up in the summers. And I really learned hard work and dedication. My grandpa was a cattle rancher and my other grandpa was a dairy farmer. And as I worked on these farms in the summer, I really learned sacrifice and dedication and giving back to your community and providing for your family. And I think that I think about them a lot in my work and how they paved the way for me. Their sacrifices gave me opportunity to be in this role. And I really want to do the best that I can well, the Department of Workforce Services is a large agency. We run a lot of federal programs and we are well known for offering assistance to people in need, whether it's through the unemployment insurance programs that we run or through our temporary public assistance programs or connecting people to jobs. We have about 2,000 employees that work in all the counties across the state. So if you need a place to come and look for a job or apply for temporary assistance, you can come to one of our one stops that's located in probably a city or community near you, or you can go online to jobs.utah.gov. So we administer programs that assist refugees as they're coming to Utah. We were recently involved with resettling over 900 individuals from Afghanistan. Throughout the pandemic, the department stood up 30 new programs. And one of the new programs that we're currently administering is the Emergency Rental Assistance Program. So it, we strongly encourage individuals, if they have an impact to paying their rent, they can apply for emergency rental assistance through the Department of Workforce Services. Something that's unique about our department is we have been working in a remote environment since about 2002 with about 300 staff. We've expanded that now to about 1,200 of our 2,000 employees that are working in a remote environment. We also have about 40% of our staff that are from rural Utah. And so we do have a vast amount of staff that are working in every corner of Utah. My vision for the agency is that we are embedded in Utah's communities, that we are connecting Utahns to new opportunities, whether it's through getting a new job, a better job, training, inviting us to a local meeting to see how we can improve your community. That's my vision for our department. If you need a job, if your family is experiencing an economic hardship, if you're an employer and we can help you out by posting a job or doing a recruitment, or if you're a training provider and you're looking to get more people into your training, those are the kinds of connections that we want to make. So reach out to us. You can go to jobs.utah.gov or you can give us a call or come into one of our one-stop centers. We're here to connect with Utah's communities.